Now, you know John stays up to date on all the latest headlines, right? Even mm -hmm. some of those unique facts that many may not know. John's here with another edition of Wiki Who. Wiki Who. Okay, guys, it goes like this. I give you three celebrities, three people of note that have something in common. Sometimes it's the name, sometimes it's not. Okay. And then I give you a semi-obscure factoid that is true about one of them, usually from their Wikipedia page. Mm -hmm. And you have to tell me which one it applies to. Okay. Okay. As always, not everybody has a factoid chosen every time, so you cannot use the process of elimination. Now, today I want I want to see if you guys can figure out the connection between these two. Oh, another game. Or okay. between these three. All right. uh, I will say it was inspired by yesterday when we asked people to send their artwork. Okay. Okay. okay? Are you ready? So today's choices are Art Garfunkel, Dudley Moore, and Jerry Stiller. Oh. Uh... Can you guess the connection? Mm. Did Dudley Moore or Jerry Stiller play arts? Any? Mm. Mm. All mm. three mm. just mm. narrowly mm. were not named America's sexiest man. <laughs> uh, they all missed out. You were you were you were digging in close there. I was close. Um, so Dudley Moore, of course, played in the movie Arthur. Oh, Arthur. Doggone. And Jerry Stiller's character on King of Queens was Arthur Spooner. So we have three ah. arts. I see what you did there. We have three arts okay. here. Okay. Okay. Question number one. Which one of the arts claims to have made 102 free throws in a row? <laughs> that sounds like a very Jerry Stiller thing to say. I'm going to go with Cody. That is ridiculous, though. You guys are both going Jerry Stiller. Yeah. Okay, guys. Well, none of these men really seem like hoopers, right? No. Uh, in fact, none of them actually even played basketball in high school. But two of them did grow up in basketball crazed New York City. Thankfully, there was a hoop close by in the summer of 1955 because it was how a young Art Garfunkel spent his days while he was battling a <laughs> young Get lung infection. Out. Oh, wow! Yeah. Wow! He, he had a lung infection, couldn't really go run around and play much. Yeah. So he shot free throws. Huh. And he says he made 102 in a row at one point. Wow. wow. Okay. That's a good little nugget. That is the most obscure one of these yeah. you've ever had. <laughs> that's yeah. great. Uh, I would never uh, guess that in a million years. And one of the most unverifiable. Yeah. Uh, question number two. Which one of the arts was born with clubbed feet? Oh. Um, I'm going to go with Dudley Arthur Moore. Same. Dudley Moore. Because you're both going Dudley mm -hmm. Moore. Well, guys, medical science has come a long way over the past century, but back in 1927, treating a condition like clubfoot was much harder. So when Jerry Stiller was born, doctors didn't have the tools they do now, but thankfully he didn't need them. Uh -huh. But things also were not much better eight years later when Dudley Moore was born Woo! with two club feet. Doctors were able wow. to uh, repair one of them, but the other one they did not. Went on to live a fruitful uh, and full life after that. Okay. Question number three. Okay. This one is also bizarre. Which one of the arts is related to the Backstreet Boys and NSYNC founder Lou Pearlman? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Yes. This is hilarious. Uh, I kind of want it to be Jerry Stiller. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go Jerry Stiller. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Both okay. going Jerry Stiller. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, guys, Rose Perlman had no idea that her son would go into show business. But she probably got a clue when he performed at his own bar mitzvah. Now, it's unclear if Lou Perlman was at his cousin's bar mitzvah that day. But imagine if he were and he decided to manage Simon and Garfunkel. <laughs> <laughs> imagine how much different that band would be. That is so funny. <laughs> How strange is that? Oh man, the choreographed dances. Oh, oh it would be fantastic. <laughs> so it just said that they're maternal cousins, and I tried to dig deeper to figure out what exactly that means, and it's kind of unclear. I just think they're cousins somewhere on his on mom's mama's side. side. That is so funny. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Those are two Did of you my. Imagine? The, the yeah. free throws and the Lou Pearlman are two of my favorite questions I've ever asked on yeah. this. <laughs> I, I think he. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I agree. That was Wiki Who, guys. That was good. That was good.